Welcome to my channel everyone. My name is Victorine B. Takwe. I am a Cameroonian based in the Northwest region of Amenda. And on this channel, I share with you all my amazing lifestyle. I love Jesus. I love traveling. I love everything that God has made. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So I'm just going to be sharing with you what I noticed as I when traveled. You want to marry, eh? Find out. The road. Find out if it's motorable. And I'm going to share with you how Oroko people do traditional weddings. Okay, so I think okay. this is going to be an amazing one. I enjoyed this vlog. I enjoyed editing this vlog, okay? So just keep watching and I'll keep you in the loop. So we left Swa before 6. I don't know how to read that kind of time. Was that long handy? Was that short handy? <laughs> Alright, so this is me. I was just checking my face before going to the southwest. Mm -hmm. Because usually when I go to Limba, I always come out with zits. Like I'm going to have one pimple or another or another so i was just doing that check and then we left this early by the time we got to omispo it was raining guys we had a rainy journey now the first observation i had was yaounde is not so alive in the morning i'm trying to compare this with duala the day we we're coming back we left duala by 5 a.m and guys the roads were full we passed through ndokoti it was like there was some party happening there it was just full so yes Duala people are better hustlers than Yaoundé people. I guess it's because Yaoundé people have office jobs. Yes, let's just settle with that. <laughs> now, for those of us that are just based in Bamenda, you haven't traveled through Yaoundé Duala Road. On the road, there are stops where you get to pay, they call them payage. Um, like toll gates, yes, toll gates. You get to pay 500 francs for your car to pass. I think it's just basic taxes, but we don't have that functional in Bamenda. <laughs> okay so observation number two guys Duala Yaoundé road the drivers are reckless everybody is trying to overtake the other person everybody is speaking and guys this is like the busiest road in Cameroon you have trucks leaving Duala from the poor and they are coming to Yaoundé it's so so busy a lot of trucks but small cars still want to pass. The big cars want to pass everybody. So Dwala Yaoundé Road, if you are not very careful, you're going to lose it. Day. And you don't only have to sit and say that, no, it's my right. I'm doing the right thing. Because somebody will come and kill you in your rights, during your rights. Oh. Observation number three. Guys, when we got to the last payage after a day, Daddy showed me this spot. This guy has the most beautiful doors I have seen in all of Cameroon. So apparently, people travel from all over, from Yaoundé, Bamenda, Douala, and they buy doors from this guy because he get away as possible he hand work to do. You, you're not going to find it somewhere else. So, so yes, we got to Douala and this brings me to my next observation. Guys, now two kind Douala day. Two kind. Now the first kind Douala this, eh? This is village and okay let's say there are three kinds all right there is the village all this mushy area and then there is the bonaberry which is also mm, i have no word for it <laughs> and then there is duala this other duala eh nah light after the tunnel <laughs> when you cross it guys bonanjo that like this is not even your match now nah. this is forget i don't even think there's a place in yaoundé as fine as this part of Douala. but we did the same country oh we're all cameroonians <laughs> oh god okay but it's beautiful i love this area of Douala, and it is expensive expensive you bring your money here yeah? you finish <laughs> so we stopped at bonaberry to pick up this noise maker drusilla eh and then a newly wed they know eh, you know and the master they don't do love you know, love you know. <laughs> all right so we made the trip now it was four of us and so they leave Dwala. somebody really believe me when you're going to limbe or to boya and you see these trees you don't know say you don't already reach ah So we reach Limbe for afternoon that day. We'll not even wash seve, we'll not even change. We'll be already late for the traditional rites. This is holiday in so we just keep our back them and then we went straight for the traditional rites. Guys, observation number four. All rock of people welcome we with collar and pepper. Raw pepper, the job grinder. So say me you take 
cola scoop pepe wanda Make me to a no shot. Tomorrow you see different man like this one. So say, hey, I don't see different man. You leave this one. If you see this one, say I leave this one. So wait around chop. I know we will make that. Yes, you understand what I'm talking? I am Ed and I'm near the Ed and I'm the family member. It's very important. It's very culture. This is the first traditional wedding rites that I'm attending. You know, we always just attend the traditional wedding when all the rites have been done. So it was really a privilege, you know. Now this is the part where the uncles get to disturb your life. <laughs> uncles will disturb you. Ah. Now after the introduction and all the agreements have been made, there is now celebration. You know, it's just boom, 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 dance, dance, dance. Oh my god, this was fun to watch and do. That was it for day one and we went back to retire and get ready for day two, the traditional wedding proper. Okay. This is this is um traditional wedding and it's raining. Seriously. Seriously. Can you imagine? <laughs> I almost fell on a bike. This almost fell. <laughs> Come on, love you today. <laughs> Guys. When I see the here so where you want to marry, eh? Find out. Find out if it's motorable. Because it's not easy at all. Why are you wearing that? I'm not in it. Yes, I'm going to take this again. This is the house, eh? Like what? See where love can take you. Love can take you to places soon. Thank Yes, yes. Uh, some I just want to take this time to greet all my fans. Rami Bell, how are you? Pearl, how are you? I'm so I know that was how. This is a red cocoa. Yes, they use red cocoa. They grate them. I felt not the only snow. You want this? Guess you have to. Don't mind me. Hi, Dave. Why me? I'm going to go. Take it, take it. I like it. I like it. I like it. 
Guys, limbe is cold. Ah, the mosquito net on a face mask. We don't discover the use now to protect you from cold. Seriously, when I was packing, I remember the last time I went to limbe it was hot, so I didn't pack things that were warm. Hmm, the story be touch. Wait, this me yesterday. No. <laughs> After waiting all day, the bride and groom were ready, everybody was ready, and then the rites began. I'm sure most of us have seen this part of traditional weddings, you know, the aunties of the bride bring veiled maidens and the husband has to choose his bride. So if you choose the wrong person, you have to pay a fine. Now, you really cannot skip paying the aunties money because they are going to bring like three sets of maidens and like the last set will have your bride. So, don't give them money for transport. She's not there. Hey. 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 Uganda, Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where When the bride is unveiled, there is the wine drinking, and after that, seriously, it's just eating. The rest of the stuff we're doing there was just city vibe. Hey! <laughs> yeah. Oh no, no, I dance, I dance, guys. Remember, I'm a very good dancer. Yeah, Therese brother said it. I don't love that talk today. I should don't know. I just say Therese brother the eye me seriously because how can somebody say that I can dance? How is that even possible? <laughs> Day three guys and yes the zit finally came out so some fat pimples so okay oh Sunday morning we're ready for church and this sign right here I've been trying to catch it and I finally did town of friendship friendship away I don't even want to tell you people my experience with one taxi guy and one bike man say friendship town Pamela will come and take will come and take them tomorrow to go to the next house for one week yeah, hey fam, so we just came back from church and daddy decided to take us to Down Beach. So we're going to eat fish. Look at that. Oh my god, amazing. Why am I yeah. doctor? You make your choice. But you know the most of us for you. You know, but now I'm going to my boy. I'm going to I'm 
They want to fresh fish. So some people, the way you choose them, so they just like cream. Where you don't put the fire, you just don't have to change the fish. But no one does it. Like, they go. No. And the consistency, maybe you are from my village. Whose village is that? Whose village is that? I don't hear their names. They are the... Yeah, village are we? I'm a dog. Ah. My name is... <laughs> hey guys, we've had rain the whole time. Okay. So we are done with our pictures right now. Okay. And we're going to Duala. Yay! Yeah. We're coming to your house. We're going to sleep in Jesila's house. You want to do the same? You want to do the same? Let's see the same for us. Newly wedded. Newly wedded. <laughs> So all we did in Duala was spend the night and we were up the next morning heading back to Yaoundé. Okay guys, we've come to the end of this vlog. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video.